हेलो फ्रेंड्स द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज इक्विवेलेंस ऑफ इक्विवेलेंस ऑफ मूरे एंड नीले मशीन वट डज इट मीन दिस मीन्स दैट इफ वी कंपेयर दीज टू मशीन वेदर इट इज मूरे और नीले विच वन इज मोर पावरफुल ओके सो एज वी डिस्कस इन द फाइनल ऑटोमेटा विदाउट आउटपुट दैट एन एफ ए डी एफ ए एंड एपसाइल एंड एन एफ ए बोथ ऑल दीज थ्री टाइप ऑफ फाइनल ऑटोमेटा आर आर इक्विवलेंट टू ईच अदर वाई बिकॉज वी कैन कन्वर्ट एनी ऑफ द फाइनल ऑटोमेटा इन टू एन अदर फाइनल ऑटोमेटा इन द सेम सेम केस इन केस ऑफ मोरे एंड नीले मशीन इन केस ऑफ मोरे एंड नीले मशीन they both these two machines are both equivalent to each other this means that if we have a mure machine then we can convert into mile and if we have a mile machine then we can convert into mure this means that's why these two machines are equivalent to each other so in this video first we see that how we convert a mure machine into a mile machine and in the next video uh we see the process the how we convert a mile machine into mure so this is the question that this is a mure machine and we have to this uh, we have to convert this mure machine into mile machine so first see here wh why this is a mure machine because the output is associated with the state not with the input so to convert it into mile machine then we have to uh, do some transition we uh, or we can say we have we uh, we take some step that uh, due to which these output which are associated with the state they can they move to the transition value or with the input value so the main step is that always whenever there is a transition is going on to a state whenever there is a transition is going to uh, another state whatever be the output associated with the state take it and print with the transition what does it mean see here if we have a uh, this is a question if we have a state like q not because the output is deleted from the state and it moved to the with the input so q, the state remain as q not q1 and q2 now see here first we consider this state q0 with the a input and b input so first we consider the a input there is a transition see there is a transition going on to a state that is a and it move from q0 to q1 so with that with this transition q the we consider the the outgoing state so from q1 the output is associated with zero then this means that this z output is associated with this transition next with this q0 with the ab transition with the b input it uh, it remain in the same state so the output associated with this state is moved to the with is moved to with the input so this means that b gives zero input then next we consider this q1 state q1 have two inputs a and b c for a q1 with the a input remain in the same state q1 which is associated with the zero output so it associated with the transition input that is a now this q1 with b input it move to the next state that is q2 and q2 is associated with the one input this means that b is associated with the one output now we consider the next state that is q2 q2 with the a input it moves to the q1 state with and this q1 state is associated with the zero output this means this a is associated with the zero output then from q2 with b input it moves to the q0 state which is which is associated with the zero output so this zero output is associated with this input b from q2 this b is associated with the zero so in in the first diagram 
state diagram the output is associated with the state that's why this is a mure machine but we convert this into mile because the out here the output is associated with the all the input not with the state therefore this is a mile machine okay so this is how we convert a mure machine into a mile machine we have to keep in mind that always whenever there is a transition which is going to a next state whatever be the output is associated with that state take this take that output and print with the transition okay now if we have to create or if we have to understood with this conversion with the help of a uh, state uh, with the transition table then see here how we can convert it first we first we create the transition table for this first mure machine okay so how we convert this see uh for the mure machine so we have three states q0 q1 and q2 and we have two inputs a and b which will be represented by del function and we have a uh, output associated with that is delta q0 is associated with zero output q1 is associated with zero output and q2 is associated with one output now see here q0 with a with a input it moves through the q1 state q1 state and this q1 is associated with the zero output okay so with this a if we have to convert q0 if we have to convert this mure machine into mile now see here q0 state with a1 a input it moves to the q1 state and this q1 is associated with zero output so we move here with we move this output with this q1 state now q0 with b input it move to the same state that is q0 and this q0 is associated with zero input so zero output so this zero is moved to the transition function now q1 q1 with the a input it move it remain in the same state that is q1 and this q1 is associated with zero output so this zero is moved with the transition a now see q1 with b input it move to the next state that is q2 and q2 is associated with the one in output so we move this one with this state now q2 q2 with q2 with a input it move to the q1 state as q1 is associated with zero output so zero this zero is associated with this transition then q2 is move to the with b input it move to the q0 state and q0 is associated with zero input therefore this zero is moved to the to this transition function after moving the, all the output associate uh, which are associated with the state now they are associated with the transition then after that we delete this output and this table this remaining table will represent the transition table for the mile machine so this is how we convert a mure machine into a mile machine so in the next video we see the procedure that how we convert a mile machine into mure machine okay then we can say that mure and mile machine both are in the same level and they are equivalent to each other so keep watching my video thank you so much